Hey, welcome to this video. And if you arrived here, you're probably searching for a review of Freemote. So I'll go over how it works and I'll give you my two cents whether I think uh, it's a good investment for you. Um, so all it is, it's, a, uh, it's, it's gonna teach you freelance web development. And what's, what's different about uh, this program, it's specifically for uh, Shopify and e-commerce. So a different angle. Um, apparently it's very in demand, this niche, and not in a lot of competition. So, so it's a unique angle. And it's run by a guy named Aaron and, and Jan, two, uh, two guys. They have seven combined seven plus years of experience in uh, web development. And uh, Aaron actually has 200,000 200, subscribers on his YouTube channel, over 200,000 now. So now, um, now, now, if you watch this video up top, he talks about you know the traditional methods of learning uh, web development, like uh, you know self study and boot camps, and the problems with those. Like with self study, um, there's just too much info, right? You're never going to be able to teach yourself, and uh, and most of the info out there isn't even relevant to landing a job. And with boot camps, uh, he actually took a twenty thousand dollar boot camp. And this, and you know, eight months long, and the success rate uh, for that was 28%. So only 28% of students were able to land a full-time job in uh, software development. So, so that's not even a third, right? That's closer to a quarter. Uh, now, um, now he talks about how over there's 10,000 uh, openings on Shopify. Up, uh, sorry, on uh, Upwork for Shopify jobs. Shopify programming jobs compared to only 9,000 and something for Python. And Python's much more difficult to learn and competitive. Um, as far as the curriculum, you'll be learning, well, it's a seven week self-paced program. Um, uh, 30, there's 30 hours of video training and it's divided into three stages. So stage one is all about web development, like HTML, CSS, uh, uh, JavaScript. So it's kind of setting the foundation uh, stage two is all about learning the Shopify platform, how to set up the store, um, you know, theme development, all of that. And then stage three is all about uh, landing freelance clients, probably the most important part. How to actually build your brand, um, you know, find jobs uh, on Upwork and stand out from the competition. Uh, you know, sending uh, contracts, communicating with uh, during the service delivery, all that good stuff. Uh, coming up with creating your portfolio, and uh, and, and in addition, in addition to the core training, you also get checklists, uh, templates, and uh, and all that good stuff, and uh, and you also get access to the community. Uh, so you get access to uh, Aaron and Jan, as well as other students going through the program. Now it's a one-time fee of six one thousand six hundred forty-nine dollars, or four payments of. $497. So it's not the cheapest course in the world, but you get what you pay for, right? If it's going to allow you to uh, switch to a more satisfying career, then then it's worth it, right? Now there's a 60 day money back guarantee, um, but only there's only a 5% refund rate. So that what that tells me is students are enjoying the program. And so they don't want a refund. Now, um, now, um, now, now, as far as testimonials, lots of raving testimonials. Like someone went from fourteen dollars an hour uh, to thirty-seven dollars an hour in one month. Uh, one of the top students is making sixty-five dollars an hour on Upwork and Rising. Um, you know, people got jobs within two weeks. So, so pretty amazing stuff. So, my final verdict for this course is: if you want to go down this route of doing freelance web development, I think this is something worth looking into. But here's the thing that gives me some sort of pause. Um, I don't, I don't know if this is the best, uh, the, 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 you know, the best way to earn a living. Uh, so there's three pillars to this, right? First of all, you have to get good at coding, and that's that's not easy. That's, um, you know, they make it sound easy, like everyone can do it, but in reality, it's an extremely, extremely technical skill, and not everyone can be a good coder. On a scale of one to ten, it's like a ten out of ten on difficulty. Um, so you have to learn how to code, and which isn't easy. And then the second pillar of this is actually pitching potential clients. So you have to become a salesman as well. So it's like two jobs in one. Um, you know, pitching clients why you're the best option and what you can do for them. And that's a whole other animal in itself. And most people suck at selling. They can't sell to save their lives. Um, I tried doing freelancing a while back, so I know how difficult it is. And I had an in-demand skill similar to coding. Um, it's just brutal. 
and you're competing with people who might live in Bangladesh who are charging, you know, $8 an hour, obviously the quality is probably isn't that high, but you still have to communicate that to potential uh, employers, right? Now, the third pillar to this is you actually have the pressure of delivering to your clients day after day, week after week, month after month, um, you know, which, which really sucks. It's like having a job. I mean, it is a step up from, from having a normal job because you can work from the comfort of your own home, but but you're still, um, you still have that constant ongoing pressure. You're gonna have to be chained to your desk all day, delivering projects. It's not passive at all. It's a very hands-on way to earn a living. Um, it's just, and it's just a job at the end of the day, right? So you're just trading time for money. Um, and there's really no leverage in that. So um, I hope that makes sense. But look, maybe you're here, you're not necessarily sold on becoming a freelance web developer. Maybe you're just looking for a way to earn money online and create more freedom in your life. Um, well, if that's the case, I was in your position, you know, a little over a year ago, I tried all sorts of stuff, blogging, freelancing, domain flipping, you know, filling out survey websites, just goofy stuff that, that doesn't work. And, uh, and, and what I found the simplest way uh, to earn a living where you don't need to be some tech wizard or some amazing salesperson or anything like that. Um, the simplest and best way and with the lowest barrier to entry is selling other people's digital products. That's called affiliate marketing. Um, now affiliate marketing, it is still fairly underground, but it's getting, it is growing in popularity. It's now a $12 billion industry. Uh, bigger than real estate, retail, and uh, and security. And uh, and what's great, you can go into any niche. It's not just the make money online niche. You can go into you know weight loss, how to get six pack abs, uh, dog training, how to build a garden, uh, how to find a spouse, um, how to build a potato gun. I mean, the list just goes on and on. And, um, and what's great about affiliate marketing, it's very simple. Like I mentioned, you don't have to handle customer service. You don't have to be a salesperson, uh, you know, deal with shipping and handling. You don't have to learn any fancy uh, tech skills like coding. Um, it's all the software you use is drag and drop pretty much. If you can press a button and drag and drop, you can, you can become an internet marketer. Um, you don't have to, so it's, so it's very uh, beginner friendly, uh, whether you're a housewife or maybe you're just working some menial job you don't have any special skills you can absolutely do affiliate marketing and uh also the costs to run the business are very low um my, my tools don't cost me more than 150 dollars a month which is a drop in the bucket and you could even get them lower if you wanted to but but why why skimp on you know good tools that's my opinion um also there's lots of leverage and automation in place unlike freelance anything <laughs> Uh, where you don't necessarily have to be there all the time. So if you're feeling lazy one day or you just want to, you know, go hiking or something, you can do that and still be generating uh, an income in the background on autopilot all day, every day. And uh, it's the one business model I found where you can really be a solopreneur and still make really good money. I'm talking a full-time income here, you know, 3000 a month, uh, 5000 a month, but potentially 10000 a month and beyond uh, in profit. And there's just not that many business opportunities out there where you can do that. So if you'd like to learn, um, so this is going on almost 10 minutes now. So if you'd like to learn how to do affiliate marketing, um, the best way that I know of and what's worked for me allowed me to quit my call center job and do this full time. Uh, all you have to do is click that link below. You'll get access. Well, first of all, you'll see my email opt-in page. So just enter your best email and I could send you a free workshop. It'll just give you the entire blueprint of how to do affiliate marketing, how to pick great products to promote, how to build out a simple sales process, how to generate leads into your business from a variety of different sources, uh, and just how to build trust with people who might live halfway across the world from you, because trust is sort of the cornerstone of any online marketing. And if you're afraid to show your face on camera, don't worry, there, there are ways around that. Um, and, and the training will talk about those ways as well. So so that's, uh, that's, that's basically all I had to say. Um, again, uh, Freemo, they're 100% legit. Um, you know, they appear to be legit, and students are getting results. It's just, um, it's just why you're here. If you're if you're here because you're truly interested in becoming a freelance web developer, then this is probably something worth looking into, and you have the 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 money to spend. Um, but if you're just here because you're, you know, you're just doing research, you don't necessarily want to be a web developer. You just want the simplest path to financial freedom. 
uh, you know, to be living that digital nomad lifestyle or whatever, um, or just being able to work from home, then I strongly urge you to consider affiliate marketing. So, so I hope you enjoyed this uh, review. I hope to see you on the other side and I hope you have a great day. Bye.